friends, good day. Welcome back to a new vlog. I didn't know I was going to do another vlog, but here I am. It's another week in my life. Honestly, I feel like I cannot not vlog anymore because I just want to be able to talk to someone at all times. Um, It's currently 2 p.m. on a Monday and I don't have class today. I have been studying English grammar. I don't like it so far, but it's fine. Grammar is just never fun. It's just the things you have to learn, so I, I get it. And now I think I'm going to explore a little bit in the area because I now literally have so much time and I just don't want to sit inside all day. And then I also want to go to the store, I think, to get a couple more things that I'm missing for my dinner tonight. And I'll take you guys along with me. I'm bringing my tote back and also my book just in case I want to sit down and read. home in the comfort of my bed i have my laptop here as you can see a little snack and i'm gonna watch hocus pocus because the second one came out a while ago and so i'm gonna rewatch the first one so that i can watch the second one on halloween maybe um i'm in such a fall halloween mood so i just want to watch something fall-ish that is not gilmore girls because I'm not vibing with Gilmore Girls. I want my full attention on something. And since Gilmore Girls is a rewatch, it's kind of like hard to always fully stay focused on it. Um, but I'm gonna do that. It's already 5 p.m. almost. So after I have my snack, I will pause the movie to summarize this big boy. All right, let's go. <laughs> I just had a little like get to know party I guess to get to know people and it was really fun because I now have the feeling that I know of, like so many more people than I did like before this evening so that's great. Um, it is now almost 12 p.m. and I did decide to go to bed because I have school tomorrow pretty early <laughs> so yeah we love that for me. Anyways good night I'll see you tomorrow. I came back from my class a while ago and I'm now um, editing my vlog from last week and I realized I ramble so much. Like, I just want to ask, are you guys interested in hearing about every class I have and every time I go to the store? Like, those kind of things. Do you guys like that or is that just annoying? Because I don't know, I'm just, I've just been editing and I've been talking for so long in this clip and I'm just like, is this even interesting or, is, oh, there's a fly, what? Mm. Okay, anyways, um, is this even interesting or like, is it just boring? Let me know. Just let me know what you like to see from these kind of vlogs. Like, do you want more like montage with voiceover uh, like I did for my travel vlogs? Or do you want more talkative, like one-on-one -on -one bestie vibes wherein I tell you everything that's going on in my life and we can all be best friends and it looks like you're in my private Snapchat story. Not that I have one, but if I did... You know, like, let me know, like, what, what do you guys like? 
from these kind of vlogs. <laughs> the best angle right now but i came back from my late class i had a class from five till eight it was very interesting oh my hand is in front of the lens that's not good youtuber behavior um that wasn't a clear english sentence i'm so sorry this is so much better okay i just came back from my class and it was really fun it was like probably the most fun class i've had so far not gonna lie that one and literature so now I only have the classes on Thursday that I haven't had yet. Lol, my hair. Um, so I'm very excited about that. I just had dinner <laughs> very late. And now I'm laying on my bed waiting for my friend to arrive. She'll be here anytime. And then I'm just gonna have fun with her. But yeah, we'll see. Anyways. Hee <laughs> hee. I'll see you. I'll see you later. <laughs> One thing I didn't really consider when going to university is that I really have to find a new routine. Like, I used to have such a set routine. I went to school the same hours from Monday till Friday in the weekends. I did my homework and spent the rest of the days just like absolutely chilling. Like I had time to read, I had time to do YouTube, whatever not. But for some reason, <laughs> I'm cozy in my bed if you couldn't tell but it's kind of obvious that now that I have a completely different life like I'm in a different place I um, school is so different from like last year <laughs> and that's normal but I didn't really realize how much that would affect my hobbies because basically all of my hobbies are things that I do alone except yeah no actually all of my hobbies are things that I do alone <laughs> and I used to just make time for them because they were really important for me but right now I just feel like when I'm not in school or doing stuff like socializing and all I just crash I sit in bed and watch YouTube videos on my laptop <laughs> and I just don't do anything basically so today I wanted to start getting back into my routines and into doing things that I love so I set myself this rule that I want to be reading 50 pages a day again i had a time last year that i read like a hundred pages every day last year i read um 51 books so almost a book a week and that was the life i love that but now i just don't have time for it and i um i read beowulf for school i read the whole thing we didn't have to read the whole thing but i i did um because it's not that much and i wanted to add it to the list of books i've read so far this year and i noticed it was only the 28th book i say only and you know i do it again like i say only 28th book and i'm always like oh it doesn't matter how much you read and blah 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 blah. but when it comes to myself i just get really disappointed knowing that i read so many more books last year and i was really focused on wanting to read as many books however now what i want more is to just find time to read again and prioritize my hobbies and what I like to do. So really two things I want to really focus on again, YouTube and reading. Those are probably like my main two hobbies and I love them, um, both of them, but it's just a little hard to do them here for some reason. It just feels so different, but I'm taking notes of this for next week. I, I have all my books with me, that's not a problem. Um, I can read whenever I want to. What I didn't bring, but wish I did, was my microphone so that I can improve the quality. I realize I'm mainly making vlogs and catching up on footage that I made over the summer. And honestly, the, like right now I wanted to edit and I realized that I did not have anything to edit. The only thing I had was something for which I had to record a voiceover but i don't have my microphone here so next week i want to bring my microphone here instead of leaving it at home where i barely use it um what else do i want to do i want to bring my journal 
because I realized I've been really wanting to journal here because I just need to I don't know there's so much happening and I feel like I need to write that down I like sharing stuff with you guys but of course I don't want to share like all of my inner feelings um, so those are things I need to take with me for next week it's a learning progress like progress process it's a learning process I've been here this is my second week now we're halfway through the week it's fine um, another thing when do I study I feel so demotivated to study I used to be the biggest like study girl like I used to love that I watched so many study videos as well and I always thought like when I go to uni I'm going to make study content and now I now I'm not even motivated <laughs> I'm just so like I don't want to do this um, but I think what I'm gonna do now I don't know what time it is but I think it's about like half past three or like 4 p.m. something like that before I have dinner I'm going to, because it's a bit early for dinner, even for me, um, I'm going to do some schoolwork, then have dinner, and then tonight I might go to this little gathering about this theater group from my university uh, to see if this is something I want to do. I kind of know it is something I want to do, but I don't know how it works. Like, I don't know if they do theater and everyone can join or if they really do auditions for productions they're doing I don't know how that goes so I want to go there but the thing is my friend that stayed over over the night needs to get her stuff still and I don't know when she's done with school so we'll see it doesn't really matter the whole point of this was that I want to spend more time on my hobbies but now I'm going to study okay <laughs> good talk <laughs> Hi friends, it's currently Thursday, not gonna lie, I'm a bit drained by this day. I had three classes today, pretty long ones, and also new ones, so it was a lot of information. And even though I liked the classes themselves, it was a bit overwhelming. Um, just so much new information, and also, it's so much, like, university is a lot, which is normal, it's supposed to be that way, but... When you're in your second week, your first full week of classes, it gets kind of scary. <laughs> or at least for me, that's how I'm experiencing it. I'm just constantly like doubting myself, like, will I be one of those people that just passes? Or will I be one of those people that has to redo their year because it's too hard for me? You know, like, I don't know. It's so different from high school as well. Like, I know in high school I was really motivated and I did a lot for school and therefore never really had to fear not passing but now it's different um but that's fine anyways tonight i'm so tired right now but tonight i have this kitchen warming thing to get to know the people on my floor which is exciting and i am looking forward to like meeting people i might not have met yet um even though i've met most of the people in my actual kitchen but it's from the whole floor and there's two kitchens on this floor so there's also more people to get to know which is fun but it's kind of draining as well because I'm like sometimes my social battery just it's just not existing and right now it's very low so what I'm gonna do at first I wanted to study but that was before I remembered that I had this kitchen warming thing so I'm gonna watch Hocus Pocus 2 <laughs> I watched the first one I re-watched the first one earlier this week and I'm gonna watch Hocus Pocus because I'm honestly not feeling like watching like shows or something i don't know i just want a movie i'm in the vibe for a good movie so i have already started it and i'm really enjoying it so far i'm like 25 minutes in it's really great um i'm gonna do that have my little coffee hopefully i will wake up from that even though i use like this much coffee and like this much milk but yeah i hope that will wake me up 
And then tomorrow I will have a little study day and I will take you guys along. I'm going to try to study in the library, which would be exciting. But I don't know if I'm going to do that. Depends on how comfortable I am in this space. But I just feel like I can't really study very well here. I don't know why. It's just not going that great. But now it's time to chill. So this morning I went to the bookstore, well morning, it wasn't that early, but anyways, I went to the bookstore to see if they had a book I need for school, but they didn't, so I'm gonna have to read the PDF file that's online, which is cheaper, so maybe it's better, but also I don't like that, I want to read a physical copy out of a physical book, but it's fine. Then I went to the library to study, which was so effective, like I studied better there than I have here in my room all week, which is good to know. Um, I think I'm gonna make use of the library more often. I actually, I just really did a lot. So I'm very happy about that. Way less stress now. Um, however, now I have to pack really fast. Well, I'm already packed, but I have to do the last minute stuff and then go to the train station to go back home. So yeah, I kinda have to hurry, okay, bye. <laughs>